Right here I have this chicken water cup set. I'm gonna go ahead and open this up and show you everything it comes with. This is everything that came inside the package. We have nine of these different cups. We have nine of these teas. And we also have nine of these little water nipples, what they're called. Then we have all the extra little connecting pieces right here, as well as one drill bit that's gonna be the perfect size to install these. I did wanna show you kind of up close what these look like. These are what the cup pieces look like. These essentially could be installed right into this PVC pipe if you would like to connect your water in that way, more like in a small line. Or you can also connect this into something like a five gallon bucket, which I think is what we're gonna be doing. You can actually just use the drill bit that it came with, drill a hole in the five gallon bucket, and then you can stick this piece right in here, get it properly secured, and then you're good to go. Basically, this is going to be the little water reservoir. I think this is gonna be a great alternative for just keeping your water nice and clean. That way they're not easily able to get it dirty or kick up dirt into it or even like poop in it or something. So that's really nice. These little water nipples, they basically just peck at that little silver piece right in the middle. And when they peck at that, it's just going to give them a little tiny bit of water right down here. So there isn't any water reservoir or any water to like go bad or get gross or anything like that. So that's a really nice option as well, depending on what kind of animal that you're using these for. It seems like these could all be used really well for a lot of different types of birds, whether that's chicken or quail or turkey or ducks. I'm gonna go ahead and just show you how we're gonna set them up. We have some quail and they just tend to get their water reservoir just super, super dirty no matter how often we clean it. As soon as we put clean water in it, I feel like there's just like poop and dirt in it um, right away afterwards. So I feel like these ones are going to be hopefully a good option. We'll just keep them nice and low so that the quail can easily push down on them. I'm gonna go ahead and walk you through that process of how we install it and then what it's like when it's done. So I feel like the main thing is just to make sure that when we do install these in the five gallon bucket that we just keep them low enough that it's going to work for the animal that you're intending this for. As you can see, we already used the drill bit to drill all of these different holes. You can see up close kind of what that looks like. It makes a really nice, perfect size hole for what we need it for. Now we're just gonna use the cup that we chose and we're just gonna screw it into place. Now we're gonna use this piece right here and screw it on the inside just to keep it fastened into place. So you can see this is what they look like. The idea is that we fill up this five gallon bucket with water and then as they want to drink water out of here, they just push down on here and it's going to fill up with water. It's gonna be really nice and simple and very hands off. I'm gonna go ahead and fill this up with water and put it in the quail coop. So as you can see right here, these automatically just filled up with water as there was water in the bucket. So as long as there's water in this bucket, it's gonna continuously fill up these little pieces, which is gonna make it so easy. 